welcome to decentralized news today i just want to talk to you guys about uh, yf die okay so this is a project that is um quite interesting you can find the token on uh, exchanges such as kucoin it's available in gate io on x markets and other exchanges you can always go to decentralized news for the best crypto reviews especially for these uh, trading platforms DeFi protocols etc so what is why f die okay so this is an entire permission less DeFi ecosystem that is uh, aiming to sort of combine staking and farming services and uh, soon also lending and borrowing services and uh, safe predict and insurance together with their own decentralized exchange called safe swap and uh, they also have their own launch pad where legitimate projects in the DeFi space can launch their new vetted projects with uh, contract audits uh, logged liquidity and also logged dev tokens in time uh, release also smart contracts so whereas uh, you find other DeFi protocols only relying on uh, minting new tokens to sustain their staking and uh, farming rewards with uh, FY die uh, you actually have allocated tokens for these products so which will be re replenished more or less with fees that are generated by the actual ecosystem so FY die also has a deflationary um, a burn mechanism that's uh, built into the platform that will also ultimately reduce the total supply to just about uh, 13,650 tokens so their mission is to pretty much try to clean up DeFi by de-risking the purchase of uh, new projects by also performing due diligence vetting and uh, sort of uh, requiring uh, some adherence to the same protocols that uh, yf die itself uh is aligned with so their motto is no more exit scams rug pulls so yeah you know i think it's uh, worth checking out their legitimacy to see if uh, they are living up to what their claims are but uh, as far as what they say their um, protocol differs from other uh, DeFi protocols they say that existing DeFi solutions more or less lack the well thought out uh, techonomics of uh, the project and uh, which are sort of uh, deflationary instead of uh, inflationary so the fees generated by the ecosystem are distributed to the burn contract and uh, the staking and farming rewards so once the total supply reaches that 13,950 mark the burning will end and the distribution of fees previously going to the burn contract will be distributed according to the governance voting so other protocols may offer staking or farming or they may offer lending or borrowing with a limited set of tokens but with uh, yf die it has a full suite of uh, DeFi products coming out of um you know the uh partnerships so fy die is also bridging the gap between DeFi and the rest of the world by uh, obtaining a financial service license and e-money license which will enable crypto to fiat exchange on their centralized exchange so this is uh, part of what they're planning and they also plan on opening an e-commerce site and issuing a debt card or a debit card sorry so yeah this is uh, interesting yf die is uh, the native token and uh, it is used to pay for fees on the site and will also facilitate governance of the yf die protocol so liquidity providers are a key component to ensure the sustainability of their DeFi protocol by sort of facilitating liquidity within that protocol so they will be rewarded with these YF DAI tokens via liquidity mining in addition to a percentage of trading and borrowing fees as well. So the platform users who uh, use FY DAI with uh, governance power uh, is, uh, you know, sort of let's say for if you're using them for lending or borrowing or trading, you will be rewarded with the governance power in the form of these tokens to encourage not only the use of the platform and its services but also to sort of uh, em encourage that distributed governance structure so they have some major listings i mean they are on kucoin uh, they are also on gate io 
and on Uniswap V2 and some other exchanges. They have different pairs, especially USDT. They've got a BTC pair on uh, KuCoin as well. Let me know if this is a project that you've heard about. Uh, this is uh, one that just kind of uh, came up as a suggestion for me to take a look into and I decided to do that. Uh, I will be doing that if you leave a comment, suggest any content types you'd like to see, but you can also check out the links in the description to my books. There's also a free ebook and links to our Telegram and our Discord channel. Like, share, subscribe, turn on that notification bell. I'll see you in the next video.